Yeah. It's the same thing with my nephew or my brother-in-law. <coughs> testing and everything came back clear. Okay. And he doesn't have no more testing. Brother-in-law, everything came back clear. So that's that's always good news to hear. You know, I have something to really say. I should have told you guys this this morning, but I substitute teach over at ETM. And Bo's grandson saw me on Friday, and he came up and gave me a hug, and he said to me, three more days and I get to go to church. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's nephew. I'm sorry. Bubby. It was Bubby. So, yeah, he's a good kid. Yeah, isn't it great the enthusiasm the kids have? Don't, and don't they encourage us? Any other praises? Okay, prayer requests. So we want to pray for, for Kevin, who's still just waiting to kind of... Tomorrow morning he gets he gets a heart cath, so he's he's struggling pretty bad uh, at home. So, uh, and we want to continue to pray for Scott and for the family. Um, how's Shorty doing? How's Shorty doing? He's a little bit better. The doctor put him on some other medicine, and he's starting to perk up a little bit. Was ninety? He'll be ninety in a month. Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, well, we'll definitely keep keep praying for for Scott and the family. So Nancy's going this Friday for hand surgery, so. All right, well, let's, uh, let's join together and, and pray. Uh, God, we, we come to you and we thank you for encouraging our hearts through answered prayer. <clears throat> Lord, we know that you are in control of things even when we feel like they're out of control. And so, God, we ask that you would take these requests that we have put before you and we ask that you would bless each one. Lord, that you would be our comforter. Lord, that you would be our encourager. Lord, we ask that you would give us that faith as, as the children have and the enthusiasm of, Lord, not only coming to church, but, Lord, day by day meeting you and looking to, to that time when we ultimately meet you face to face, Father. We, we thank you for that, that blessed hope that you give us. We ask that, a church, that as a church that you can use us in this community and we, uh, we pray for our country. We pray for our community. Lord, we thank you for the veterans that have uh, given so much in, in ways that we can't even imagine. Uh, Lord, to not only honor you, but to serve this country. Thank you most of all for Jesus. And we pray the prayer that he taught us to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen.